I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to do some undertones and veining. This is Little Tiger Lily by Cassie Brace. This is how I start all of my blank kits. She's already been cleaned. I wash her down with some alcohol. You get all the oils and debris off of her. First I start with the temple undertones. This needs to blend in so that you can't see that it's got a start line or a stop line. It just needs to be blended completely down so it's it looks like it's below the surface. So now you can see it's a subtle hue but it's not sticking out like a sore thumb. Again on the other side. I choose to do this section first because I like the way that it makes it look deep below the surface. I know some artists will put it on top of a few layers, but I just like building it as the, the base layer underneath my underneath my work. This area is important because it's naturally very thin. There's not a lot of meat between the bones and the top layers of flesh, so you see a little more blue in this area traditionally. Now this is easy to overdo. If you get it too dark, then it will definitely look really horrible. Too much blue can be a death sentence to a baby. It just looks not alive if it's too blue. So there's a healthy balance. You have to get just the right amount. Okay, so those are her blue undertones. I'm going to turn off my overhead lights and see if I can show a more realistic version of the blue. It's there, but it's not sticking out. So if you can seriously see it too bright, then you have it too thick and it's too dark and you need to go back to the drawing board, take it off and start over. All right, so we're going to pop the light back on. I always work under a daylight LED light lamp to light my area so I get the best coloring. Next we're going to go to our feet and do the undertones on our feet. And again, you blend it in so that you don't see any lines. Let it come up onto the inside of the foot. And we're going to add just a little bit underneath the ankle bone. And then we're going to add a little bit under the outside of the ankle bone. And now we're going to go right across the top of the toes. Blend these in good so they don't look like they're going to fall off from lack of circulation. Okay, the last part for the undertones is under the back of the leg. Now 
on the inside of the leg, it's a, a lot more blood flow from your major artery. So I do a little bit of blue in here. Now we're going to do a hand. Okay, just into the palm of the hand. On the underside of these fingers. top of the fingers. And then a little crotch of the arm. Now I'll come in in the next video and show you the veins. The veins will also go in this area, um, but this is just the first step, the undertones. Okay, so that's the first step. I have two more limbs to do, but you've seen one half, so I'll assume that you can carry on with the second half by copying the first half. Um, I will pick up the next video with veining. See you soon.